Even Tourism Minister Mahesh Sharma has created a controversy with his remark. This is a bizarre diktat that was given by him while he was responding to questions from the media. The Tourism Minister Mahesh Sharma advising tourists not to wear short skirts and refrain from going out alone at night, especially if they happen to be in small towns, saying that tourists must follow the given welcome kit, which have details of do's and don'ts while they're visiting our country. The Tourism Minister also advised tourists to click a picture of the registration number of the vehicle that they would be traveling in and send it to a friend. But outrage soon has uh, spread over this bizarre remark restricting women from wearing short skirts and under fire Mahesh Sarma immediately issued a clarification saying that he was only referring to religious places and that he spoke out of concern for the tourists visiting our country. Let's listen in. Pariyatakon ko jab wo airport par aate hain unko ek welcome kit di ja rahi hai ek card hai usme ki jisme do's and don'ts kya kare aur kya na kare jaise choti choti baatein humne unhe bataya ek bhai aap choti jagah par रात रात के टाइम अकेले ना निकले स्कर्ट्स पे ना पहने दूसरा हमने उन्हें बताया कि आप जिस गाड़ी में बैठे उस गाड़ी की नंबर प्लेट का फोटो ले लें और अपने एक रिमोट अपने किसी दोस्त को किसी को उसको फॉरवर्ड कर दें तो जब आप किसी धार्मिक स्थल पर जाएं तो कृपया वहां की मान्यताओं का ध्यान रखें जैसे हमने उदाहरण भी दिया जैसे किसी आप गुरुद्वारे में जाएं तो सर ढक कर जाते हैं किसी मंदिर में जाते हैं तो जूते उतार कर जाते हैं इसी के विषय के अंदर उसी संज्ञान को लिया गया और हम भारत सरकार का ना कोई ये सोच है कि हम किसी को ये आगाह करें कि वो क्या कपड़े पहने ना पहने कितना पहने पैंट पहने कमीज पहने मैं अभी बेटियों का बाप हूँ और मेरी बेटियाँ स्कर्ट भी पहनती हैं मेरी बेटियाँ पैंट भी पहनती हैं वो सलवार भी पहनती हैं और एक लोकतांत्रिक देश होने के नाते हमारा ये कर्तव्य नहीं है ना हमारी जिम्मेदारी है कि हम पूरे जब विश्व के पर्यटकों को हम यहाँ पर आमंत्रित करते हैं लेकिन उनकी सुरक्षा का सफाई का उनका उन ध्यान देना हमारा जिम्मेदारी है एडवाइज सतर्कता के लिए कहना अगर गुनाह है तो मैं समझता हूँ ये उचित नहीं है Okay, a quick clarification by the tourism minister, but his comments have already sparked a huge controversy. Let's just listen into some reactions coming in to what the tourism minister had to say earlier on in that diktat, in that advisory that he had for women tourists asking them not to wear short skirts during their visit to our country. Well, if uh, Pandit Mahesh Sharma has his way, he will put every woman in a, woman, woman in a burqa. The culture minister of India at times comes out with the most uncultured remarks possible. Okay, now the tourism ministry says that this welcome kit that has been given to tourists on their arrival to India is only as a precautionary measure. But interestingly, we also have a reaction from a tourist and this is what the tourists had to say on the union minister's advice. It's none of his business to comment on what women wear and I really don't understand why women always get in trouble for the way they supposedly behave or what they wear when the ones who are causing the problems are men. And I don't see how it's a problem what we wear. If I go into the Taj Mahal, I'm not even allowed to take in cigarettes that took them off me. Or even though for me it's clear I'm not smoking in there. I think it's totally unjust and no man should comment on what a woman is supposed to wear. I think we're pretty well capable of deciding for ourselves what we wear. And if men are having a problem with this, then it's the man's problem, but it's not our problem. India Today's Ilma Hassan joins us for more on this. Ilma, we just heard the reaction of one female tourist and visibly upset with the advice given by the tourism minister. But what are the other reactions that have you been getting in from various other tourists about this so-called diktat by our tourism minister for their safety? Uh, well, Avantika, you just heard the reaction of Elena. She's a tourist from Austria. She said that she was in Agra yesterday when Mahesh Sharma did make this comment. And when she read this in the papers in the morning, she said she was furious. She said that since the weather in India is so hot, she shouldn't have to ca compromise on what she's wearing. And it is the men who should be taking care of, you know, how they look at women. She said that she wants to be able to wear whatever she wants to. And she even wants a 14-year-old daughter to be able to do the same. And what Alina said resounded with every tourist I spoke to who said that they were not expecting such a comment from the Union Minister of India. They said that they should be able to feel free about what they wear and how they choose to dress in whichever city it is that they go to.
But very interestingly, finding himself on the back foot and facing enough criticism, the tourism minister, Elena, immediately issued a clarification saying that, uh, you know, his statement was only for the security of women. But isn't it unfortunate that we are giving out welcome kits to the tourists visiting our country rather than sensitizing our very own people and, uh, you know, just informing and educating them how to behave with tourists who are coming to our country? Yes, and that's exactly what all the tourists who I spoke to said today. They said that if they're coming to India, they, you know, so many tourists come in, num in strong in thousands of numbers on a daily basis and they shouldn't have to be careful about what they wear. They said that they want to feel welcome and they're already a little cautious about how they choose to dress in India and this, uh, this bike coming from an official just gets them even more scared about safety. All right, Hilma there. Thank you so much for joining us and telling us more about the various reactions that have been coming in from tourists who are visiting India on what the tourism minister had to advise to them.